guys, I had an awesome day today. Oh my gosh, truly was a dream come true in every sense of the word. You see, I have been doing a science experiment for a whole year now and the results are in. I was diagnosed with rheumatoid arthritis, osteoarthritis, and I had a meniscus tear in my left knee and all kinds of scar tissue and degenerative bone issues. I needed full knee replacement in both of my knees. My hands were disfigured. I was told I needed to go to the cancer treatment center for infusion treatments for my severe rheumatoid arthritis. I could no longer hold a pen or write my name. And I was fast becoming very disabled and couldn't even get around. And uh, yeah, so the pandemic hit our country as it did all over the world. And I made a very drastic decision. I decided I'd had enough. And if you've been watching my channel, you know <laughs> that this has been a long journey. Well, today's the day. I actually got to speak to my doctor after a whole year. And boy, what a visit it was. Now, because the pandemic is still going on, our visit was uh, via teleconference. And so uh, I'm gonna share that with you. But first, I'd like you to realize a few things that I truly was very disabled the last time she saw me. And this whole year, as I began to learn how to heal myself, uh, she had no idea what was going on. We hadn't even touched bases since the pandemic has hit. So today truly was our first meeting uh, since she saw me last so sick and, and disabled. Uh, I was having to go to the emergency room on a regular basis. Uh, I was having fluid drawn off of my abdomen, you know, two and four liters at a time. I was very sick. Uh, I was having terrible cramping, uh, and I was beginning, my joints and my hands were beginning to disfigure, and as I explained, I was really, really in bad shape. And so... I got my results today from my lab work. So yeah, three days ago, I went to the lab and that was a Friday. And so all weekend long, I've been waiting on pins and needles for those results to see if all of my hard work, all of that meditation, all of that visualization uh, to see if it has paid off. Well, you know, that's kind of silly because obviously, look at me, it has truly paid off physically, right? But there's always that little doubt, you know, I just have to see those results. I just, I just want to see it in black and white, an actual representation proof in a graph, in a lab test that shows that this truly is a thing and you truly can do this. Well, look at all the, the lab tests I printed out. There are so many pages and pages of lab tests that I printed out. And I have to tell you, every single one of them is similar to this. Meaning, this was then, this is now off the charts, in trouble sick, now doing better. Um, what does that mean? Well, I have pages and pages of these graphs and it means every single blood test they could think of. They tested sedimentary rate, which is uh, inflammatory, uh, inflammatory uh, factor right? that they test for people who have cancer or lupus or rheumatoid arthritis. 
uh, you know, all the lipid tests, um, my iron test, every single comprehensive metabolic test. There's not every single page looks something like this. Dramatic results before and after. And in case you didn't catch that, the before is a year ago. And we're now uh, in March 2021. And these were all last year, just a year ago. I'm not on any meds. Haven't been for a year. I did all of that through meditation. I'm a woman of science. I needed proof. Would you like to see what the doctor said? I got something else to tell you. When you start this meditation business, it truly is scientific as well. It's not just mysticism. There's science behind this. That's one of the reasons why I was able to talk myself into giving it a try and trying this experiment on myself. A, I didn't want to be sick anymore, so I had to do something, right? So why not do a year-long science experiment on yourself? What did I have to lose? Uh, nothing, except maybe get well. That was the only consequence I could see for trying it, so I did. So got my lab test back, and... Uh, but the whole time in those meditations, I have to say, I would picture the doctor you're about to see. I would picture her face asking me, what did you do? I pictured handing her my lab test saying, take a look, doc. You know, waiting for the big surprise and the look on her face to, to prove to myself that this whole time I've been doing this, that I really am affecting my biology. And I picture her saying, what did you do? <laughs> Makes me cry. <laughs> you gotta see this, you gotta see this. All right. We've got to talk about this. This is, this is crazy. This is, I, I don't know what to say.